Sea and punishment, sin and coconuts. Dairy rife. Byakuya and Teru Teru died just last night. Just last night, you mean like a week ago, right? I think you mean a week ago. <laughs> An ordeal like that doesn't change the fact that I still get hungry. I learned this firsthand as I headed toward the hotel restaurant with dreary, sullen footsteps. Let's see. All right. Introductions. Got it. The ultimate gamer. Girl gamer. State your business. Well, I just want to introduce myself. Is that all right with you? An introduction. Understood. I don't mind. I'm Hajime Hinata. Nice to meet you. Peko Pekoyama. Peko 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 Peko. That's quite the name. Ultimate Swordswoman. Peko Peko. This girl's super cute. Oh, hi! Who are you? Um, I'm Hajime Hinata. Hello, your tension is super low. Are you feeling all right? Ah, that's right. Introductions are a go-go. Oh my god, she's so hyperactive. Holy shit. The ultimate musician. I'm not surprised. Hey, aren't you the guy who was squatting on the beach earlier and burying your face in your arms? Yeah. Hey, you gotta keep it together, you know? At times like this, it's the boy's job to keep the girls safe. You're right. Hi, hi. Do you want me to introduce myself? I haven't done it yet, right? Let's see. Oh. Ultimate photographer. Ah, I could have pieced that together. Mondo has returned. Ultimate Yakuza. Ah, oh, that explains it. That's right, you haven't told me your name. My name. Nekomaru Nidai. You and me haven't been introduced yet, right? Dude, his name is Soda. Yo, are we gonna drink him? Kazuichi Soda, the ultimate mechanic. With really creepy teeth. In honor of your courage, I shall reveal to you my name. May you never forget it as long as you live. You may call me Gundam Tanaka. Sick name. Ultimate Breeder. Oh, that's super lewd. Yo, the... Awari. The ultimate gymnast. Oh, she's literally Hina. Squish, squish. What's this kid doing? She's sitting down and she keeps pressing her finger onto the floor with all her strength. Um, are you okay? I haven't introduced myself, right? My name is Hajime Hinata. Hiyoko Sionji. The ultimate traditional dancer. I bet she's a pole dancer. <laughs> no, it's not Neko Mario. This smell is coming from you, Hyoko. Dude, why does Hyoko smell? Whoa, it's true. Hyoko, you reek. A rotten smell stings my eyes as if a demonic eclipse is about to commence. <laughs> Smelly lolly, you. Get away from me. You're gross. 
Oh, she's crying. I've said it before here, but you guys are really insensitive. I'm thinking I'm gonna nickname red haired girl the Tumblr Chan. Oh uh, no, it actually doesn't smell that bad. I mean, as long as I breathe with my mouth. Stop crying. Are you even taking baths? No. You haven't bathed? I can't help it. I can't tie my kimono sash by myself. That's fucking gross, dude. Ew. Hey, Yoko, you don't have to cry so much. I'll tie your sash for you, okay? Apparently, I'm offline according to the bot chat. That sucks. Really? I can only tie a simple knot, but if that's okay with you, I can teach you. Yay! I love you, Mahiru. I'll give you a kiss. Hey, Hiyoko, you don't have to hug me. She appears to have taken a liking to you. Welcome to the world of girl love. It's slippery when wet. Aw, oh, dude, Hibiki's so good. <laughs> Now, now, we're both girls. There's no need to be shy. B but... Let's go! And then I, beyond the steam, I saw the nut. No, the urge that was resting on this island. Oh. Hello. <laughs> <laughs> the fuck is going on? There you go, chat. <laughs> oh! Just like chestnuts roasting on an open fire, my urges are boiling, churning and unloading inside my heart. Kazu Kazuichi suddenly shouted, and what he was looking at was near the diner's entrance. Oh, fuck. As I turned around. No, 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 no. Oh, yes! Oh, what, what was I worried about? What was I even worried about? Shake it, baby. Shake it, baby. Shake it, baby. I couldn't keep myself from staring like an idiot. <laughs> the size is a little small, but this was the only swimsuit that fit me. I really want to put a banana next to her mouth, but I won't. Oh, who is it this time? Damn, son. Yeah, that's a little swimming. All right, what kind of sexy swimsuit is Miss Sonia wearing? <laughs> Get fucking destroyed, Kazuichi. Uh. Wrecked bitch. <laughs> Is she crying? Don't say that's racist, Soda. Doesn't she seem a little strange? <sighs> Chad, excuse me to make a really, really fucking obvious joke. Hold on. There. Fine, I did it. Are you happy? No one was telling me to do it, but I did it anyways. <laughs> oh, I'm hilarious. I am funny. <laughs> Come on, mate.
Oh, no. 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 Yep. Fucking hell. Shit. That makes sense after Lolly Chan was running away, but still. I won't believe it. The moment I stepped inside the beach house, those words mercilessly shattered into pieces. Oh no, one of the girls! Fucking damn it. Oh dude, it's the mask. If this was all a dream. When did I, when did I begin dreaming? If this is reality, why is my hero on the floor covered in blood? I couldn't understand anything that was in front of me. And I couldn't believe in anything. It's starting. The class trial is starting. Mahiru Koizumi, the ultimate photographer. She had a, an unyielding force of personality, but she was actually very good at taking care of people. Most importantly, she was always straightforward. The person that killed her... ...is among us. I don't want to believe it. I don't want to believe it. I don't want to believe it, but... I miss you, Byakuya. Regardless, we need to find the answer. It doesn't matter if you believe it or not. Because it's the only way. Aside from finding out who the killer is, there is no other way for us to survive. And so, this life-threatening trial billowing with hope and despair has begun. It's like all evidence points towards the lolly, but with how these games are, the most obvious one is like never the one it actually is. So this will be interesting. Focus and think. The object the killer used to escape out the window. Dude, I can't think. Oh man, Hangman's Gambit, baby. Idle Skewer returns. Fuck, I don't know. It's a long word, man. What's that? Uh, let's go with W. Let's go with B. Alright, easy. B. It's fucking easy, mate. This makes perfect sense. It's obviously going to be A. Still don't know what the fuck it is, though. Oh, bamboo. Fuck. We got there. We got there, baby. Bamboo. I need another B. Bamboo what? Bamboo skewer. Easy. Bamboo S. Bamboo shower. Oh, yeah, okay. That makes sense. But I'm good at Oh, that's- I need an H, huh? Oh, you dummy. Fucking idiot. Dude, I'm running out of health. I should probably stop running out of health. Wait, no. No, that's not enough letters. I'm stupid. Duh. Whoa. Bamboo sword. <laughs> we did it. Fucking did it, Reddit. Fucking did it. Fuck me in the face. That was terrible. All fucking mixed up. We got there. Uh, from Fox Eye Valkyrie, I still lick the mask right off Peko's face. That's lewd. That's super lewd, man. Thank you for the tip, Fox Eye. だけど、そんな二人の約束を聞いていた人物がいた。そいつこそが今回の事件の犯人なんだよ。I love how they draw the killer in these pretty fucking 
その約束を利用したある殺人計画を思いついたあるものを用意することで2人の行動を操ろうと企んだんだそしてそのまま14時30分になると今度は小泉がビーチハウスを訪れた自分が殺人の標的として狙われているとも知らずになそんな無防備な小泉に背後から近づいた犯人はある凶器を構えたあの現場に残ってた金属バットだバットは小泉の後頭部に振り下ろされそこで小泉は生きていた積み木の検視によると小泉は即死だったらしいから犯人が誰かもわからないまま殺されたんだろうなそしてそのまま時間が経つと睡眠薬の効果が消えたサイオン寺が目を覚ましたクローゼットから出てきたサイオン寺はかなり動揺したはずだ会う約束をしていたはずの小泉がなぜか目の前で死んでたんだからなサイオンジはそのショックと自分が疑われるかもしれないという焦りから慌ててビーチハウスを飛び出してしまったんだそのせいでサイオンジは砂浜に足跡を残してしまったんだこうしてビーチハウスを後にした犯人は何食わぬ顔で俺たちの前に現れたシアーキスプンスーツが髪と水着はすぐには乾かないそれを拭くタオルもビーチハウスにはなかっただから犯人は言い訳のために俺たちにこう言ったんだどうだこれがお前が起こした事件の真相だそうだよなエコヤマテコ私には小泉を殺す動機などないし殺す理由もなければ殺す意思もない私はただ道具として使われただけだ道具である以上はねえ何でそれを使うのヒカパッカーと私は生きてきた。Are you two childhood friends then? Yeah. No, it's completely different than that. Right after I was born and abandoned by my parents, the Kuzuryu clan took me in. They gave me a reason to exist. I am to fulfill my duty as my young master's property. That's lewd. It means she's a hitman arranged by my clan to work directly under me. ボッチャが殺意を抱けば剣となって殺す私は人間である前にボッチャの道具なのだこの体が動かなくなる時まで私はその役割を全うしてみせるベイビーソード終わりましたよヤングマスター、I am finished て,てめえ何やってんだ Thank you for the dick res of sound It's pretty thin. Thanks for the ship. Thanks for the ship. I'm terribly sorry. I will not be able to serve by your side until the very end, young master. Sayonara. Goodbye. <sighs> And I'm sorry for what I've done to you all, too. It may be a selfish request, but please forgive my young master. <laughs> And please do not cause a senseless killing <laughs> such as this ever again. <laughs> of course. <laughs> <laughs> That will do, Monokuma. Why don't you start it already? Just so you know, I will never feel despair. As long as I am a tool, I am fully prepared to die. So cool. But will you be able to maintain that composure until the very end? People who act as proud as you always shed tears of despair in the end. Now then, let's begin. I feel like this is going to be a really hardcore death scene. I'm excited. 
Please for me to make one final selfish request. Didn't I tell you not to call me young master? The tool, Peko Peko Yama, who used to stand beside you. I would like it if you remembered that. <laughs> That's it. How many times do you have to keep? I don't need any tools. <sighs> you did say that. Then let's begin. The punishment time brimming with despair. Why don't you get it yet? You stayed by my side all this time. Why don't you get it? <laughs> Monokuma getting ignored. I never needed a sword or a shield. I never needed to... God, this game is such fucking good story. Let's give it everything we've got. You just, you just, oh. He's talking, my bad. I, I... Oh. God damn it. Young master? Sucks. That sucks, dude. feel very good. Thank you 8-bit 8 8 Alex for the 14 months. Oh god. One woman army, Jesus Christ. It's like a butter knife. Interesting one. It sucked, but it was interesting. Sucked as in feels. Double kill. Are they both dead? That's weird. Yeah, what the fuck? I was not expecting that. Okay. Jeez, I guess I have no choice. Well, there's no way I can violate a rule, even if it's me. Fine then, I'll save him. Really? I was actually gonna do that all along, so I've already prepared for this. Huh? Prepared? And that's when it happened. A siren began ringing from out of nowhere, and gradually grew closer and closer. I'll thank you after this, Delta. Sorry for the wait. An ambulance? You've already killed your patients. You're dancing right now. I 
And after he said that, the ambulance containing Monokuma and Fuyuhiko vanished from our sight. And so the class trial ended, but we still can't see the real ending that we really want yet. When that finally arrives, what will have happened to us by then? No matter where I look, no matter what possibilities I look for, I can't see our future. Not even a speck. As if we were in a boat, floating unreliably in a vast dark sea. We were just left there, alone. Only one word could explain our situation. Despair. We couldn't find a more suitable word than that. Time for another island to get opened. Yeah, dude, that was only chapter two. God, this game's so fucking hard. I really want to lower the difficulty. Next trial. That was a good chapter. That was quite a good chapter. Good trial, too. I'm just shit. It's like I spend more time getting mad at myself than enjoying the trial more. 